I am reviewing the Samsung Level U Pro and neckband Bluetooth wireless headphone, which I received for free for an unbiased review. I'm testing this with my Samsung Galaxy S4, and my test consists of listening to Google Play Music, uh, quite a bit of that, and connecting it to my gaming PC. And um, surprisingly, they, they work good as a gaming headphones. I was not expecting that. Um, the unit itself is extremely light. I mean, it's for a neckband. I was not expecting that. Um, the, the comfortable on the shoulders, never really noticed it there. Easy to jog with. Um, the Bluetooth pairing was very simple. There's a switch on the bottom here. Uh, you just flip this on and then you hold it over to the far side towards this, uh, where you see here, this far right for a few seconds and then you can pair with your phone. That was a very smooth process. Uh, connected to my S4, uh, almost instantly, no issues. Sound quality, uh, very good. Uh, I would say extremely good for uh, wireless Bluetooth headphones. Uh, good highs, good lows. Uh, the vocals, the mids, vocals, mostly vocals, really popped out to me. They were really good. This is by far where it exceeded everything I expected. Um, the the music, uh, like I said, some music I played, you know, always had difficulty picking out the lyrics themselves, what they actually are singing. Uh, with these, it, it just popped out as clear as day. Uh, I was amazed at the difference it made. The um, This headphone set also supports ultra high quality audio through Bluetooth. Unfortunately, my phone itself doesn't support that, so I couldn't really test that. Um, the headphones to me didn't seem like they were the loudest ones I ever heard. They were plenty loud for me. I mean, you could turn them up and you're not going to hear anybody talking to you, hear any of the noise going on around you. Uh, it makes it good for the gym. You know, no one's going to bother you while you're, you're, you got these on. Um, but, you know, every once in a while you get that jam, you want to just crank up and it didn't seem like I could get it out to the ear bleeding level. You know, you, most people won't need that. But uh, it just seems like always having like one or two more levels up would have been awesome. Now, uh, saying that, my S4 always seems to, tends to seem quieter than other phones. Like the S5, I noticed even with Bluetooth or just headphones everything else, the uh, S5 always seemed louder than my S4. So it could just be my phone. Now, Samsung also provides this select level app uh, for their uh, Samsung devices. Uh, it's mostly uh, an EQ, decent EQ. Uh, it comes with two different interfaces. The first one's a simple one, bass and treble. Uh, and then the second one's uh, like a seven band equalizer. Um, the allows you also to manage notifications being sent to your headphones. So your different apps, your text messages, everything like that, and you know, reading your text message, whatnot. Um, you can also change the act, the action, of connecting or disconnecting based on these magnetic uh, earbuds here. So what happens when you're playing your music and you connect them together, by default it pauses your music. Um, if you unconnect them by default it does not start your music playing, but through that select level app you can change that action so it will if you want. Um, but it's a neat feature, uh, didn't expect it, uh, and uh, you know it's uh, plus. Uh, another feature they have that I couldn't test was this share sound. Basically it allows you to connect and also that's using the select level app connect multiple of these Samsung level U or level U pros together I think up to two uh, and share whatever you're listening to. Um, interesting feature didn't get a chance to test it. I don't have a second unit but you know it's not something I would buy it for but it's a interesting extra um, the quality call quality on this was excellent um, I kind of expected that after I, I seen what the voice quality was uh, of vocal quality I mean of the music so the voice didn't let down my expectations at all it was great and in fact the, the mic pickup was even better than the one built into my handset into the s4 so I was quite pleased with that um, the uh, as I said, I tested as a gaming headset with a Bluetooth dongle on my gaming rig. Uh, worked great for that. Uh, people could understand me on the other end. I could hear them quite well. 
It may not have the surround sound features of some of the gaming headsets, but it worked good. Um, the headphones are rated as sweat resistant, uh, and I have to say I have no issue with those. I took them to the gym when jogging, sweating, everything was fine. So no issues there. Uh, definitely sweat resistant, and they work good in the gym. Battery life was rated for nine hours. I've I don't think I've hit nine hours straight listening to anything, but I've gone a whole week without charging this thing, listening at the gym, listening on the side, making phone calls, and everything, and it's worked great. So I would be safe to say that if it's not nine hours, it's really close to nine hours. Um, the only real bad thing, and it's, it's very minor, I would say, is on the side, the buttons here. You got your volume up and volume down, your play pause, and this is also like an action button down at the bottom for phone calls come in um, those don't have much tactile difference um, that would be one thing I'd like to to add but it's not a deal breaker uh, the other thing it would have been really nice if the earbuds would retract into the the neck band but once again not a deal breaker for me uh, it's uh, it was just I was trying to find something to pick on this thing for because sound quality is great um, so Originally, this thing was priced $100, um, and you can get it now on Amazon for less than $60. At $100, you're going to find other units of similar quality, if not maybe even better. At $60, this thing is getting very competitive and very nice. Um, my, my current uh, unit I use there, in earbuds, they don't sound near as good as this. Now, it wasn't as expensive as this, but... I, I was just totally amazed. This is the best sounding Bluetooth headset I purchased myself. Now, I haven't bought anything over the $60 for headsets. Um, so, the I've heard some other ones at the $100. I've tested them out and everything like that. And they, they uh, you know, some sound just as good as this, some sound better, and some are a lot more expensive. So, overall, for the price that you can get this for now, this thing is excellent. It's a great buy. I highly recommend it. Um, I, I'm very happy with it and uh, if you're thinking if you're looking at spending you know $60 range for uh, a headset and your neck band uh, is not an issue for you I would say go for the Samsung Level U Pro um, comes in two colors uh, this one's the bronze and also comes in a black but once again it's a great overall headphone and great for taking phone calls